And now I invite uh, uh, Peter, who is the Secretary of the National Fish Workers Forum, uh, to uh, give his uh, points of view. I welcome FAO initiative on voluntary guidelines of securing sustainable small-scale fisheries. These guidelines recommend that fishing communities should be given traditional rights over coastal areas and fish resources. It also mentioned that the entry of outside force into the operational area of traditional fisher folk will lead to conflict over the access of the resources. The FAO recognizes that in such a situation, government are, governments are due to bound the intervene in the interest of the fishing community. Despite that, this uh, pro, the progressive ideas in FAO guidelines, the reality in third world countries is completely to the contrary. For example, in India, the government is actively promoting the interest of the foreign fishing vessels to operate in direct competition with the traditional boats. Therefore, the rights of the traditional communities are under attack. Indian territorial waters extended to 200 nautical miles and therefore, the rights of the fish in these waters is with the Indian traditional fishing communities. But currently, the attempt is through new policies to constrain our rights to only two nautical, 12 nautical miles. It is only by protecting our fish resources that the traditional community can be prote protected. Therefore, both the foreign and the domestic Unscientific fishing methods that undermine our marine resources should be discouraged. For example, pristine fishing, pair trolling, and bull trolling that devastate marine resources are being encouraged by the government. Another point of concern is the indiscriminate catch of the juvenile fish which affect future sustainable sustenance of marine fish resources. In Muttam, Tamil Nadu, there are factories that process juvenile fishes, juvenile fish as fish meal, poultry meal, and uh, fertilizer. This, this unsustainable practice should immediately be prohibited. Further, massive toxic waste from urban centers such as chemicals, plastics, etc. are being pumped in indiscriminately into the sea, affecting the livelihood of the poisoning of the fish that is an important source of the nutrient for the mass, masses. Much of India, India's nuclear and thermal power plant expansion is targeted to coastal areas and uh, this will be lead to the further losses of, uh, losses of land, livelihood and the pollution of our coastal waters and inland water bodies. Recognizing and challenging the above situation is critical if we want to move to the more sustainable fisheries policy that is gender sensitive, economically just and environmentally sustainable. But this cannot be done by the fishing community alone. This new approach should also recognize the right of the communities over coastal land. The state needs to proactively help the fishing community through provision of adequate credit, creation of new institutions and the research bodies, provision of marketing, marketing facilities and access to environmentally friendly technologies. We also question against the signing of the international free trade agreement that will allow the import of fish and the fish products and provide access to foreign trawlers through the LOP 
into the in our territorial waters finally i would like to conclude my saying that unless we situated the challenge of the sustainable fisheries with with the current policy political economy con contest increasing of privatization rush of large infrastructure and energy projects the looming challenge challenge the climate change wto and fts will be not move forward while we critic the challenge to this development we must also put forward our proactive people oriented and the scientific up uh, professions that will help us ensure to sustainable policy in traditional and small scale fisheries the, the entire fishing community people are here from kerala to gujarat and kanyamari to gujarat uh, kanyamari to west bengal if you go against the fishing community definitely i am sure our fisher folk will come in front of the these officers so again i am i hope you will do the best the favor of the fishing community thank you